So the yellow box does take a few seconds to log in, turn on and all that stuff. So it does take a while. Um, we're just using monitor mode today just to show you how to change these settings. You hold down your, to edit your overlays, go back into the text menu again and we'll just quickly show you. So you have advanced settings, you have text correction which is and gesture typing. So I've actually turned my gesture uh, settings off uh, and the text correcting because uh, personally I'm dyslexic and I find it really complicated trying to type in what I want to type in and then it doesn't recognize my spelling and I'd rather go back and be able to manually edit what I've typed in properly so um, that's why in this menu I've um, you can turn off auto correction or um, there's a gesture control which I found particularly confusing when I'm trying to type in what I want to type in um, I found that quite irritating so um, yeah so I honestly don't understand why there isn't a back menu on this I have asked the developers um, the the developers and the guys who make this on the YouTube uh, sorry on the Facebook group um, are really cool and they are really personable you can just chat to them and send them messages and they'll respond so um, I've asked them a few questions particularly how to get onto this menu because I had no clue that was how you did it anyway I'm gonna have to reset this again so if you're gonna change those settings you don't want to do it in the middle of a stream you don't want to do it in the middle of recording so it's best to set them up beforehand so that you don't have to go through all this in the middle of a stream